Good morning everyone, today it is Wednesday and I thought I would vlog this week because I have quite an exciting two days coming up. I've just finished packing my bag because today I'm off to Edinburgh with Anna for our final beauty chat live with Clarins. I don't think I've ever been to Edinburgh before, I don't know why I can't remember, maybe I went as a kid, but I definitely haven't been in like my adult life so I'm so excited. Gutted though because we were meant to have beauty chat live events tonight and then we were meant to have a full day tomorrow to explore but I had to change my flight to early in the morning but it is for an exciting reason so I will show you guys tomorrow. But I'm really looking forward to heading to Edinburgh, catching up with Anna and I think we've got a couple of free hours this afternoon to explore before the event where we're gonna meet you guys and I can't wait. So I've just finished packing up my bag and I think I'm ready to shut my case, which is always a scary moment because I hope I've packed everything. So frustrating because I don't think my last video went into people's subscription boxes on YouTube and I have no idea, like I have contacts at YouTube and it's still this like myth of how how this happens because I asked Anna if it was in her subscription box and she said it was but then my friend Georgia it wasn't in hers and it's so frustrating when we work hard on videos and then there's just no way of people knowing that it's even on there because it hasn't gone into subscription boxes so woken up to find out that that is the case which is very frustrating I've emailed someone on YouTube to find out if there's anything I can do to help that situation but I'm not sure there is so if you haven't seen my Sephora haul and liquid lipstick try on video I will link it up at the top of the screen um, if you want to go have a watch. I'm sorry if you missed it. I'm in the airport now. I had to force myself to sleep in the car because I felt so car sick. And I've just met up with Anna, who is here, and obviously doesn't have a bag to check in because she's packed everything into a tiny backpack. Ridiculous. I have a reason though, because of this thing I'm doing tomorrow. I've got so many clothes with me. All right, cup of tea, and then we're gonna go and find our flight. We have arrived in Edinburgh. We've just checked into our rooms and the flight was not great, not gonna lie. I knew that was gonna be a bad one. I felt panicky before we'd even taken off and I hated the entire takeoff, but I made it, I survived. As always, absolutely fine. Just did not enjoy it at all. But we're here and I'm really happy to be here. I definitely haven't been here before. I don't recognize anything. So we're gonna go out for a wonder. We've got maybe like a few hours. We're gonna walk around, get something to eat, explore the local area, come back, get ready for tonight and then come and meet you guys. I'm so excited. We're just walk into the kind of shopping area. Look how beautiful it is. Actually, all you can see right now is this wall. <laughs> but look, woo. That's pro. Yeah, what well, you said. He wants to be there. He wants to be there. <laughs> this photo shoot that I have tomorrow, they've just emailed me saying that I need to wear something colourful. And you guys know what my wardrobe looks like. So this is why I know we have limited time in Edinburgh, but I'm going to have to go to Topshop because I don't have anything colourful. The most colourful thing I have in my wardrobe is grey. I don't think that'll do. <laughs> We're trying to find somewhere to get some food. We're getting very distracted by Whistles, Lululemon. There's some really good shops here in Edinburgh. Um, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and find the Clarins hub that we're going to be at tonight so we know where we're going. We just found the hub. It's down here. Look at this amazing view. The castle is right above it. So cool. Okay, I think I found a jacket slash top in Zara and we made a little detour past Space NK and now we're on Thistle Street, which is a really nice little cobbledy road. We've been recommended a good Thai restaurant. <laughs> Restaurant. Restaurant. <laughs> a good Thai restaurant. So we're gonna have late lunch slash early dinner and then go back to the hotel to change. Um, but even though we're not doing cultural things, I think we're having a good view of Edinburgh. Is this restaurant closed or open? Oh no, they don't open till six. Apparently Fishers in the city is also meant to be very good, which is right here opposite. Ooh! We've walked up like a million steps. I'm so out of breath and wheezy. Clearly the personal training is not working yet. We're off to find a place called Mary's Milk Bar because loads of you guys tweeted us recommending it. It's meant to be a really nice ice cream shop. So we're just walking down a pretty road now to try and find it. We're back at the hotel now and we haven't got long to get ready but I'm just gonna like touch up my makeup and I wanna curl my hair. Oh crap, I didn't bring any products with me. Ugh. Hopefully Anna has some kind of texturizing spray with her. I knew I forgot something. It's because I packed really early this morning. And anyway, look how cool the room is. This is the side. Bathroom's super swanky. And the bed looks really nice. All right, I'm gonna put some curls in my hair. All right, I'm ready. I've just topped up my makeup a bit, put on uh, the Anastasia liquid lipstick and done my hair, but it's all just gonna, I don't know what's gonna happen to it because it's got no product in it and it's freshly washed from last night. So that's a bit of a disaster. 
Um, I might see if I can like find somewhere to get some product on the way. Anna's just found out there's Uber in Edinburgh, so she's pretty happy about that. Um, <laughs> which will help the hair situation if we don't have to walk in the wind. Five minutes away. I like your leather trousers. Thanks. Very nice. All right, let's do this. While we're waiting for our Uber, I'm going to do an outfit of the evening with Anna because you look very chic. Go on then, Thanks. talk us through. Reese scarf. Nice. Zara jacket is like a dressing gown. Love I like it. it. Reese top, like knitwear because I thought it might be quite cold. Yeah. It's not at all. <laughs> I thought it might be. Zara trousers, Aldo shoes. This is back. Oh, you look so chic. He's here. Hey. Ooh. We've just got to the, the Clarins Urban Oasis that I thought I'd show you around. We've got glasses here ready for the champagne and it's basically amazing. Isn't it so cool in here? It smells so good. It smells, do you know why? Because this thing, letting off the smell. So this is where everyone kind of sits. I haven't vlogged at the other venue so I thought I'd show you. Everyone kind of sits here and there's like yummy food and then me and Anna go sit on this scary stage which isn't that scary once we're on there. And then we kind of chat to people, do a little Q&A and there's loads of stuff going on here like facials and samples and stuff. It's very cool. But we had the best time tonight. Was so cool. I loved. I, mean, I loved everyone in Edinburgh. Oh, so <laughs> Are you laughing because you didn't realise I was vlogging? Oh, <laughs> it happens all the time. So I'm glad okay. you joined in. Okay. I look. I know they're too embarrassed. This is the lovely Clarence girls <laughs> giggling over there. <laughs> Amazing. Did you have a nice evening? It was so nice. Was everyone was so friendly, friendly and so lovely. I just want to hug everyone. Seriously, me and Anna got busy lally in the second session and like started talking about. We started like trying to make emoji faces like. Uh, yeah. What is that? That's the like wonky mouth one. <laughs> anyway, I'm pretty hungry. We're gonna go back to the hotel and I'm, I'm up for some chips or pasta or something like that. Something carby. Um, and then we're gonna head to bed. Oh, I'm feeling all like buzzy. Like when you come off the finish of school play. It's, I've had too much lemonade. <laughs> we're back at the hotel and we're trying local gins. And this is like a Royal Gala flavored gin and it's amazing and it's got like some apple slices it's the best gin ever we just stayed up in the bar downstairs eating like pita bread and hummus and chips and it was great and having like local gin and tonic really really nice i am going to get ready for bed i need to like shower and epilate because tomorrow i'm on a photo shoot i'll try and explain a bit more tomorrow but it's kind of a bit of a teaser because i'm going to talk about it properly in may so i probably won't talk too much about it now but i'm basically doing a photo shoot with teenage cancer trust i'm so so honored to be asked to be involved in this project it's for their campaign coming up in may which is all about protecting your skin in the sun you guys know it's a topic that means so much to me but i as i said i'm going to talk about it properly in may but i am going to show the shoot tomorrow just like parts of it. So I'm gonna head to bed and I'll see you in the morning. Bye. Morning guys. It was definitely a struggle to get up this morning at like six o'clock. I'm just not an early morning person, but I'm all packed up and my makeup's kind of semi done because I'm always so nervous about getting other people to do my makeup. There is a makeup artist at the shoot today, but I just don't wanna not look like me. So I've kind of done my makeup and I thought they can always touch it up if I need to and I can put on a lip and they can like tong my hair or something. Um, so I'm going to head downstairs to the lobby to meet Anna and we're going to get on a flight home to London. <laughs> meeting up with Teenage Cancer Trust and they've got Jake Quickendom who was from X Factor and a girl called Katie Millen and they both have personal connections to the charity so they're like filming this cool video they've like made a beach and I'm basically coming along to have a look do a bit of filming and then take some photos later so I'm a little bit of an extra on today but I'm looking forward to going to meet everyone and as I said I'll tell you more about the campaign when it's actually launched. I'm gonna go take some photos now with Jake and I'll show you guys the 
um, a little set that they've put in the middle of the shopping center, but I thought I'd quickly show you what I'm wearing. I picked up this bomber in Zara yesterday. I really like it, it's got like a kind of floral print on it with black details and a gray t-shirt, little gold necklace, some ripped jeans, which you can't really see, and my Converse. And yeah, I'm gonna go outside now. I'll show you the set, what's going on. So this is what the little set looks like in the shopping centre. There's some, it's like a little picnic beach scene going on. Okay, cool, let's get going. <laughs> Um, you having a good day? Yes, very good. How are you? I am. You've I, just done a, a photo shoot. And now I'm whizzing off again. And you go in. She's leaving me oh. to do it all by myself. Now you're gonna, well, you're gonna go talk to people <laughs> in the yeah. shopping centre. Yeah, do you want to play my Jake's How to Be uh, yeah. Cool This Summer Just Like Me game show? Yeah? Yeah, so right. Wait, um, am I allowed to do this? Yeah. It's gonna ruin the game. Yeah. What okay. should you do before going out in the sun? A, buy an SPF, fifth, SPF and, oh, I can't read. <laughs> we'll, we'll do this again later. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, the, I think the photos came out well. I'm looking forward to seeing them in May when they all come out. Um, Jake's a really nice guy. He's now like filming in the shopping centre and talking to loads of people about like staying um, protected in the sun. That was fun. Really looking forward to talking to you guys about the campaign. I'm now going to head home. I'm so tired. I woke up at 6 this morning and 6 yesterday and I need a nap. And I need to catch up on Hollyoaks. I'm back home now. I'm actually really happy to be home. Um, it took two and a half hours to get back from that shopping centre. So much traffic in London today because it's the day before um, Good Friday, so people are just travelling everywhere, and that was quite a painful journey because <laughs> I get quite travel sick. Um, but I'm happy to be home and I'm snuggled up with a blanket. I'm gonna watch a little bit of TV and then I'm gonna go to my sister's. I really should just like stay put, but I cannot be bothered to cook, and so I asked her if she'd make me dinner, and she said yes. So I'm gonna go around there for dinner. Hopefully have some nice like comfort food. I also thought a question came up during Beauty Chat Live last night about my fear of flying and I wondered if you guys wanted me to make a video about it. Thinking about making a video, doing a bit of a Q&A inside the video at some point as well and just talking about my personal fear of flying because I do feel like it's a little bit different from other people I know that are scared of flying. I think we all have like our different worries and it could be quite an interesting video. I don't know if anyone would watch it. It'd be one of those videos that probably wouldn't get very good views compared to my other videos, but I'd like want to make it. So let me know what you think, if you'd be interested in that. I'm wearing the Kat Von D um, liquid lipstick in Love Sick, which I really like, and everyone's very complimentary of it when I wear it. I'm heading to my sister's now. I think she's planning on making fajitas, so I'm gonna go over and help her. I'm listening to loads of throwback tunes and having a great time in the car. I've been stuck in traffic for ages, but these old school 90s tunes are really helping. I'm listening to Dream, He Loves You Not. Let me know if you know that song. I've brought my sister a Lizelle Cleanse and Polish because she has really dry eczema skin and loves using this stuff. It's good for her skin. Oh gosh, this is where all the frizzy bits come out to play at this time of night. Look, seriously, one, two, three, four. If you don't already follow me on Snapchat, this is pretty much what you can expect from my Snapchat. But I am home now, I had a nice kind of chilled evening with my sister, we had fajitas and watched The People vs OJ, which I'm completely addicted to by the way. Happy to be home, still have not unpacked this mess, um, really need to get to that. But I'm going to sign off here, and if I'm not mistaken, then this is my 499th video that I have uploaded on YouTube which is insane. Which means that my next video on Sunday is my 500th video and 
not gonna lie, I've been lying to you guys. I've had a secret. I've been keeping a very special video under wraps for quite a few months. <laughs> so, as long as I've got my maths correct, and this is definitely my 499th video, then the next video you're gonna see is my 500th video, and it's a special one. So, don't forget to subscribe. Definitely get excited. And thank you so much for watching my vlog. See you soon. Night. <laughs>